In a significant development at the Muritala Mohammed Airport's command of the Nigerian Customs Service, officers intercepted a shipment of Tramadol tablets worth 3.5 billion naira. The drug originated from Bangladesh, exceeded the large legal dosage permitted in the country. Ifunaya Eze has that report. The groundbreaking discovery outlined by Comptroller Mohammed Yusuf marks a pivotal moment in the ongoing battle against controlled drugs. According to Comptroller Yusuf, the uncovered Tramadol shipment, valued at 3.5 billion naira, surpassed the legal dosage permitted in Nigeria. He knows that the interception sends a clear message about the commitment to curbing illegal activities that pose severe threats to public health. For most consignments at the port, because of the fast nature in which they are cleared, they don't take so much days. But these consignments were kept for about a week. As soon as, of course, we had this intelligence, we were kept on under, under watch. And within the period in question, since they didn't come, we opened and we discovered these are tramadols. And immediately, keeping them there for too long will be counterproductive. So, I, so we have to move them. And as you can see, we have so many of them here, to the tune of about 3.5 billion. If this tramadol is allowed to go into the public, you can imagine the effects it will have on the public. Handing the tramadol shipment to the National Drug Law Enforcement Agency, Controller Yusuf credited the success of the operation to effective intelligence sharing, noting that collaboration between agencies played a crucial role in facilitating the seizure of the tramadol tablets. In the spirit of interdepartmental relationship or synergy, we are handing this total number of farm adults, what about 3.5 billion naira, giving value to NDLA. When we have the intelligence, we share it with them, we, we, we could monitor it, then when it's time for them to hand over, if it's not possible for us to continue from there, and they are the ones to seize because they are in the abundant area, they take it to custody, then we'll not take it over. But for all you know, we have intelligence on this already, and we're de developing it, and eventually we'll get down to whoever is behind the ship. Comptroller Mohamed Yusuf also shared the financial achievements of the Mutala Mohamed Airport Command. Between January and October 2023, the command generated 74.2 billion naira, surpassing its 2022 collection for the same period by more than 14.2 billion naira. Ifunanya Eze, TVC News, Lagos.